Hey guys, um, today was just a horrible day. If you follow me on Twitter, you pretty much know what was going on. Um, my tire went flat, not completely flat. I was able to actually get to a Walmart after my aunt helped me put air in the tire. Um, if I, I just, I overreacted over something that wasn't that, but I mean, there was a hole in it. There was a, there was a big hole, and I thought, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, not today, not today. I actually ended up spending only $148 at Walmart and only had to wait 15 minutes. If I had went to an auto shop, it would have been hours. I would have been there all day. And I just was just like, great. Oh my god, just great. You know? Um, but I ended up being completely done with everything by the time I need to go pick up berries, so that was pretty awesome. Um, I went to the doctor today, and that's where my story pretty much... The flat tire thing got fixed. I wasn't that upset. I was more upset the fact that my doctor, um, my gastroenterologist specialist, thinks that vomiting every day at least four times a day, I, that's if I eat four times a day, um, isn't a big deal. Apparently not eating and vomiting, no big deal. Not a big deal. It won't kill you. No. No. Yeah, what you read on the internet? No. That's wrong, apparently. This is the second doctor that's told me there's nothing to worry about. So apparently my almost passing out at work, my getting dizzy constantly, my sore throat that won't go away, and my throat that hurts like hell, my ears hurt, my I get chest pains, all this, don't, that doesn't matter. No, I'm going to be fine. I'm going to be just fucking fine. Sorry for the cussing, but I am completely mad. I am 100% pissed off, and I'm trying to keep my composure about me because that's who I am. <laughs> no, I'm. I am just. I should have told that lady. I said, "What? You know, am I just going to supposed to die now or something?" And she goes, "You're not going to die from it. It's no big deal." And then she wants to pop me full of depression medicine and anxiety pills. I'm like, "Look." I had mono, which mono can, you know, cause depression and stuff, and then, you know, not eating can affect your moods, you know, duh. I mean, God, where did she go to school and get her degree? Stupid Bill? Like, I'm sick of dealing with stupid people. I'm just tired of it. But anyway, um, that was my day. Very annoying. But I went to my mailbox, and I was excited because from my friend, my new friend Bradley, he, um, he sent me something. See, this is a little post-it. <laughs> he said it was so neat, and it actually says, love the blog, and it's like a little notepad, and I'm so excited about this, because I do need notepads. You can never have enough of these when you keep forgetting what's going on, and um, Sonic sent me, or sent Barry a DVD, and the puppy dog, um, and a letter, and um, a card, um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, that was an upside. Sorry, I'm not talking too much about it. I'm just, I've had a really rough day, so I apologize for not getting so excited. I've just <laughs> had a really bad day, but this did make my day. Um, getting these, this mail made my day a little brighter. Um, I, I really love that this is like the sticky note stuff. Um, I'm very excited. Uh, sorry if my enthusiasm just isn't. Yeah. Oh my god! I'm just more like, oh my god, I want to go smack that lady in the face. So, with that, I'm going to bid you farewell. And have a wonderful day, night, morning, week, lifetime, year, millennium, whatever. Bye, you guys. Love you. Yep, I bite my nails. What's it to you?